Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. In this one, I'm going to show you how to create a custom GIF or GIF just like this. I've got a GIF here running inside Google Chrome and it ends in .gif. That's how you know it's a GIF and I made it. I'm going to show you how to do it in Premiere Pro. It should only take about a minute or two. Let's start from scratch. I'm going to click into Premiere Pro and you'll see here I've got some stuff going on. I'm going to delete all this and show you how to do it one by one, step by step. Okay, first step, grab your Finder or your Windows Explorer. Find the movie or the video that you want to use. In this case, I'm going to use the first five seconds from the movie End of Watch. And the reason why I'm doing that is because I like the sailboat slash uh, pirate boat at the beginning. So I'm going to drag that into the project panel, then I drag it into the timeline. Now, the whole video is here, and I don't want that. So I just want the first five seconds. So I'm going to zoom way in and I'm going to go to the first five second mark. So I'm just going to move the playhead to where it says five seconds. It's not quite there, so I'm just going to go step back. One, two, three, four. First five seconds, that's what I want. Now, I'm going to go ahead and cut it here. So Command K on a Mac, Control K on a PC, or you can just use the slice tool. And I'm just going to delete the right. And now all I got here is the five seconds that I want to make a GIF of. All right, hopefully you're following along with me. Now, up at the top here, you'll see File, then you'll see export, and then you'll see media. This is where we want to be. Right now, I've got an animated GIF format selected, but in all probability, you're going to see this here when you first do this. It's going to be format H.264 quality, whatever your video quality was by default. What you need to do is you need to click on this format dropdown, select animated GIF, then go down a little further here and we can make a couple of changes. We can go ahead and adjust the frame rate. This is one that I tend to adjust a little bit. The reason why is it comes out whatever your video that you put in, that's the frame rate that it's going to render at. For animated GIFs, sometimes you want to go for that 90s, you know, low quality, before video got compressed, ugly stop, stop motion look. You can do that by selecting a frame rate of like, let's say 10 or 12 and a half or eight, and you can get that old school 90s look. You don't always want it, but if you want it, this is how you do it. You can also adjust the frame size if you choose. So right now it defaults to whatever your video was, but if you want it to be wider or you want it to be uh, narrower uh, or higher, or, you know, taller, etc., you can go in here and adjust it. You can also unlock this button here to make it, you know, not uh, the aspect ratio can be adjusted. So you can adjust the aspect ratio and the look of it. I'm going to leave it as is. I'm going to go over here to the right side. I'm going to make sure again that it's uh, going in as a GIF. It's going to my desktop. I'm just going to go ahead and click on export. It takes a few seconds and then presto. I'm going to go over to Finder. Then I'm going to switch back to my desktop and that should be done by then when I get here. Where is my desktop? There it is. And then presto, end of watch dot GIF or dot GIF. Now to just check it, right click on it, open with and then I am going to select Google Chrome and it works. You can make a GIF or a GIF of anything inside Premiere Pro. That's how you do it. Thanks for watching.